Istanbul, city of legends. Capital of three former empires. It sits at the crossroads of Europe and Asia. The only city in the world that straddles two continents. In the spring of 2004, a consortium of international engineers began work on the Marmore Tunnel Project. This $3 billion rail system will tie in a 47-mile commuter line with existing networks. The master stroke of the project is the 1.2-mile tunnel under the Bosporus. Just two miles from the submerged tunnel, a major hub station is being built at Yenikopa, a busy suburb inside the original Byzantine capital. Engineers were empowered to scrape away a swath of modern buildings. Among the tons of sandy soil were the remains of an extraordinary site. A huge Roman-built harbor dating to the 4th century AD. Dr. Ufu Kuchabash is one of the lead archaeologists on the site. He, together with a team of 750 people, have uncovered ancient city and harbor walls and recovered thousands of artifacts from the deep alluvial soil. While the discovery has delighted historians, it has completely derailed the engineers. Overnight, work on the new station came to a halt, delaying the entire tunnel rail link. When it was discovered in 2005, the entire port was submerged in a sea of soil. There are several theories as to why. Some put it down to nothing more sinister than 700 years of river silt. But other experts believe the port's demise was speeded up by a catastrophic natural disaster. Fifteen of the ships found at Yenikapa are thought to have sunk at exactly the same time. All of them forced into the deep alluvial sediment. Professor Kochabas believes the evidence points to one thing. Tsunami, a Japanese word meaning harbor wave, is usually the result of an earthquake under the sea. The engineers of the Marmore Tunnel Project have been paying close attention to these findings. It's unlikely that the submerged tunnel lying deep underwater would be affected by a tsunami. But what about the stations being built by the sea? Entrances to the stations will be raised to around 15 feet above sea level and giant floodgates will automatically close in emergencies. The discoveries at Yenikapa have rapidly advanced our understanding of ancient Constantinople. This archaeological dig would not have been possible if it wasn't for the Marmarai project and its engineers. And history has continued to inform the Marmarai project on crucial decisions. The Theodosian Harbor discovery informed engineers of the potential devastation from a tsunami. Learning from the past is part of living in Istanbul. And with a history stretching back through millennia, people here have learned to be patient. In Istanbul, we live on archaeology and we live in history. This tunnel will be built. Of course, it will be a little bit delayed, but we have waited to construct this tunnel around 147 years. We can wait a couple of years more.